Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel Decor Up. My name is Nupur. I am an architect and here we discuss how to make your home look lux. And today we will get to know how to make a most amazing gallery wall. What is a gallery wall you'll ask? A gallery wall is a curated display of photographs, posters, or prints creatively arranged on a wall using photo frames. And how are we going to get the most beautiful gallery wall? Well, by following five basic rules. Rule number 1 is composition. Composition is the most important factor when designing a gallery wall. Finding a bunch of photos and putting them on the wall is not what it is. There has to be a composition. Decide a number of pictures you want to put up. It should not be less than 5. Then find a suitable wall and keeping in view the theme of your decor, find suitable frames. You must ensure that there is a margin between frame and picture to enhance the overall look. There has to be some breathing space. The wall should be one where a person can stand and admire it from up close. It shouldn't be a distant place where it appears fuzzy thing in the background. Stairs are just perfect for such a display. Please promise me that you'll not decide to add pictures on the go. Like you'll not start adding pictures every now and then to the gallery wall. It is essential to find a suitable composition and stick to it. Now rule number 2. Rule number 2 is visual clarity. It is essential to un- ensure that it should not look chaotic or confusing. Size should vary from pictures and their frames but maintain some kind of cohesiveness in them. Like as a color theme can be decided it and adhere to. A common border margin in the picture frame has to be maintained in all the pictures. Picture frames should be kept of the same family. It should not be too busy or too chaotic and don't please don't put pictures from top to bottom on the wall. Leave some space on all four sides of the wall. Overcrowded gallery walls are just nightmare. Well, the rule number 3. Mix up the sizes. The gallery walls with the same size pictures look really nice. However, they are more suitable for a formal setting like office corridors. In residences, it is better to mix up sizes for a more fun fun structure. The color theme has to be kept in mind and avoid having a monochrome set. Monochrome monochrome sets again suit for the formal settings. For homes, find pictures of a particular color theme. It has to be followed loosely. Avoid using strictly the same color pictures because then it will become very boring. Thoda loosely follow karna hai. Rule number four: mock up. Please do not start putting the pictures without first putting up the mock up. And how do you do the mock up thing? Uh, trace the pictures on a newspaper or chart paper. Cut them out and tape them on the wall to the composition you want to put them in. Don't forget to use a measuring tape to measure the exact distances between two pictures and use a leveler to ensure that mock up pieces are perfectly horizontal. Crooked pictures look very shabby. Find the most suitable composition and let it be there for a while, if possible for a day. It will give you a, give you more confidence and clarity on how your gallery wall is actually going to look. Rule number 5. Correct way to hang pictures. Once you have put up the mock papers on the wall and finalized the composition, then put a small amount of paint or nail polish on the hook plate where a nail has to be put and press it on the mock paper. It will leave a mark on the paper exactly where you are supposed to drill. Again, use a leveler to ensure that they are perfectly horizontal. Following all these rules will ensure that you have a fabulous wall with all the sweetest memories on it. Don't forget uh, to send me those pictures of your lovely gallery wall. Well that was the video guys so if you like this video please click on the like button and please subscribe to my channel for more videos on home decor and much more thank you bye bye